So here's often another area where we find issues with ant capping. So we have here a, a dwarf wall. This is actually suspending a slab, so we can see the concrete coming through here. Um, an engaged pier here. So you can see that they've put some ant capping on this engaged pier, but the ant capping only goes for the actual width of the pier itself. So behind this pier, there's a, there's a nice little gap there. Termites can come in behind this ant capping and then into the timbers, which obviously go, here's your flooring, and that goes straight into the structure itself. Also, anywhere behind this dwarf wall, this bearer here is covering over the edge of the slab. So once again, anywhere in this brickwork, uh, at potential termite entry points that can, uh, where they can, termites can get into this bearer, and then obviously to the rest of the structure. So whilst there is one piece of end capping here visible on the engaged piers, it, it's not sufficient. It would actually need to key in to that concrete slab, um, and then that would need to run for the whole length of this particular foundation wall for this ant capping to be effective. So it just looks good on the surface, but in reality, that's not preventing any termites getting in.